one, and go. Next step in this line, I think we will start with this engine right here. So, this is an original character made by the YouTuber Bosher Studios and 794. I hope I'm saying his name right. But this character's name is Emma. Now, originally, Emma is brown with LBSC and the number 109 and yellow lining. For my um, design, she has lavender, black lines, and... You have a friend from school named Emma. Yep, I do. This says LBSC and 109, like his OC Emma. This was made from Primrose's old model. It still has the face. So, I'm thinking of making this Roger's girlfriend. Someone asked me if I can make one. I'm thinking of using Emma in Thomas and Lady's Equestrian Adventures. So, one thing I forgot to add, I noticed this just now. This window here in the front doesn't have that on this side. Oh, yep, you have to modify it. I'll have to fix that sometime. Okay. But what do you think of this version of Emma? I might think of adding Steve, John, Mick, and Pete. Those are the other four E2s from Thomas's early years. Okay. Moving right along, I think we will look at Bluebell and Primrose. Someone told me that Bluebell is a girl. And I'd like to thank them for pointing that out. These two were made from my old Stepney and Jinty models, because someone told me that Stepney looked weird. Okay. So, Bluebell and Primrose may be hard to tell apart. They are twins, and they're both female. Although I'm thinking of writing their names on the bottom. Well, that would be good. So you don't get baffled. Baffled means confused. Next, I think we will look at this engine here. So, this is kind of a cute one. This is the orange Chinese engine from the movie Big World Big Adventures. So let me explain about this engine. It's a female, but she does not have a name. She's the same shape as Edward, it's just a recolor. So this engine was seen when Thomas was um, trying to find Mia, but then he saw an orange engine, who he thought he was Nia, which happened to be this engine. I like the burgundy and orange together. It looks good. I think this is pretty interesting. She's from China. Cool. I might give her a name, but I can't think of a good Chinese female name. Oh, maybe someone can suggest one. Yeah, maybe. Anyways, that was number four. So, I think we will start next with this one. Now, this is one of my favorites. You guessed her well, she's from MLP. This engine's name is Princess Celestia. Kelvin Rogers has asked me if I can make Princess Luna. I'm thinking of making her as well. So let me explain, explain about Princess Celestia. So, she's a character from MLP. I don't know much about her. All I know is that she probably inspired Twilight to learn about friendship and Twilight writes letters to her. I think she's royalty as well. Maybe you guys can tell me more about Princess Celestia, but about her model. I used a Thomas Wood Caitlin, and I think I got the stripes pretty well. So, the face looks pretty good. I mean, that captures Princess Celestia very well. Maybe you guys can agree. I think okay. this is a pretty interesting model. Number six. Okay, so I think we will look at Bash and Dash, the logging locos. There's going to be a Thomas Wood Ferdinand, but I don't know when he's coming out. So someone told me that the reason why these two aren't in the series anymore is because everyone hates Bash, Dash, and Ferdinand. So, I don't know why these two are most hated. It could be that they are Bill and Ben ripoffs. Maybe you guys can tell me why you hate Bash, Dash, and Ferdinand. I thought they were okay, but I understand maybe if you guys hate these. But I thought they looked okay. They look good to me. So, 
I kind of like the swapped colors, like Bash's boiler is blue. Yeah, it looks like you cut them in half and then switched them. If you're wondering where I got these from, this was made from William's old model and 16's old model. This was William and this was 16. I'm thinking of making a new William because William's not this type of saddle tank engine. Okay. Although I do like these customs of bash and dash, but let me tell you. Okay, one more. We have time for one more. So I think the last one we'll look at is this one. So this is, ow. This <laughs> is jumper. Wilbert, the forest engine. You may have seen Wilbert a ton of times, but I kept on changing him. But this might be my permanent Wilbert. This is the new and improved Wilbert. If you're wondering, how did I make this so well? This is actually a Thomas Winrowy duck. It was Duck's old model before I 3D printed him. So what I asked Dad to do was smooth this down like file it. Oh wow. Did to make the drum? boiler round. Yep. Let me see if I can get a better picture. It's hard to show up here. Run open that door real quick. Only light. He doesn't really show up because he's blue. Okay. Anyways. Oh yeah, there's better. Wilbert still has his old face. I do have a new 16 model because someone told me 16 has six wheels. But I forgot to add him to this custom video. I might show him in the future, but I just don't know when. It's so hard to see. He's like stealth. Okay. Thanks for watching this part, and stay tuned for the last part, where we look at these remaining eight engines. See you soon.